I don't like how you can see me in it. But even I'm new to uh hey, what's happening? This is so weird. <laughs> All right. Uh what's up everybody? This is fun as offensive. Think of this as nothing more than my internal monologue with visual narration. It's a new channel with a bunch of different stuff going on. I love action figures. I love movies. I'm a big health and fitness nut. There's going to be so much going on with this channel. I implore you to stay tuned. Subscribe and do all that crap. I'm telling you, it's going to be great. You can check me out on TikTok. You can see what you got a taste of coming up for this channel, but it's going to be great. And I don't know, I guess that's maybe it, but any which way you look at it, aside from all that, welcome to Fun is Offensive. Today we're ever going to, this is how stupid it's going to be, my God. I really hope y'all can stick with me because it's hard to get a simple train of thought across, but we're just going to go with this. My mind literally has 57,000 different things going on at every time, so anyway, just bear with me. So I'm reviewing this bad boy today, and I can't wait to get them open. I love Ninja Turtles. I always have. I mean, I'll do more videos in the future and stuff, but I mean, you can see my TikTok. I love Ninja Turtles. But anyway, I hope y'all stick with me on this channel. I'm telling you, it's going to be fun. That's the key word here, brothers. Fun. All right? Okay? All right, well, stick with me. I'm going to crack this thing open. I'm going to crack him open right here. I don't know, man. I guess people want to see me open this thing up, so whatever. Let's just do it. Let's just rip right in. All right. I mean, that is one beefy figure, dude. That thing is hefty. Kind of like uh, Violator was with McFarlane. But, uh, yeah. Ba boom ba boom Looks like we got all of his hands. Do, 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 do in the back. Got this crazy looking turd of a tail. I'll break that out in a second. Uh, all right. Holy shit. Come on now. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah! Can we get him? Can we get him? We gonna get him? Yeah. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. Let's get this sucker out of here. Oh, man. Oh, do I got them all out? Nope. No, I don't. No, I don't. There's a twisty. There's a... What we have here is a twisty tie. You just... Twisty tie. Got it. All those nice hands. Bet you I can already see, where's my hand at? Give me my hand. Bet you I can already see all that paint chipping off. That paint chipping off. I'm gonna put this to the side, so we'll come back to it. Just bear with me. All right, here it goes. Oh, geez. All right, put them to the side. Look at that sweet ass knife. That thing is gonna be diggity dope. It looks like we have a little different, looks like a smoke bomb, regular grenades. Nice. All right, moment of tr oh, let's, let's down a little bit. Okay, let's get all this, all this plastic crap. All right, so, God, man. first impressions alone. Oh, thank goodness I don't have to heat those joints up. Oh, man. Talk about moving nice, dude. That is smooth. They're only single jointed arms and knees. So y'all can just go ahead and remember all that. But dude, that ankles are good. Man, ankles are real good. It's kind of like Isagi Jimbo, but a little bit better. I'd say a lot better. All right. Dude, just look at that, man. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Bro. Bro. Get out of here with that, dude. Please say it swivels. Oh, yeah. There it is. Look at that. What's it look like in camera? Dude, that looks vicious. I 
wish you could see it. I want to see it. But I mean, it's got some really good articulation in here. All right. Like, I'm not going to lie to you. The sculpt on this, like, look at the amount of detail they put in here. I don't know if, it, again, it's coming up on camera or not. But, dude, that is... There's so many different color, like, sh small shade changes in the orange going right around the tips to give it that depth look. Man. Like, I even really love that you can see each individual little bump in there, every scale raise. Dude, my camera's not good enough to show truly how great this is, but... Man, it is just insane. And the red eyes. Oh, are you kidding me with those red eyes, dude? Don't even tell me this is articulated. Don't even tell me he has an articulated jaw. He's got an articulated jaw. Oh, man. Dude, just look at that. Look at that movement, dude. What's that up there? Is it a bird? He just is so beefy. Okay. So let's just get into it. All right. Um, it's just, it is such a good representation from the comics, from the game. I mean, it is just so sick. And that diaphragm, just the amount of, let's just see how far we can get him. Let's just test his waters. All right. That's looking like a small... It's got a small little knee joint there. Let's get it the good light. Okay, so it doesn't give you that much in the knee, but that is absolutely still fine. Because I'm not expecting this thing to be a Spider-Man in terms of posability. Man, it's just so sick. I am so excited with this thing, dude. I gotta get into some good poses. Oh, man. Just look at that. Just look at that. Who would have expected that from a NECA figure? Granted, okay, as much as I do love Ninja Turtles and I'm a fan of them, I would not buy the NECA cartoon turtles. Now, it's going to be kind of trigger warning for all you sensitive people out there, but I just don't... Oh, no. All right, and we're back. I thought I had some technical difficulties going on there, but I was totes my goats wrong on that right there. All right, so... Let's see, what else am I going to talk about with this? Like, oh, man. Just, like, the color scheme on the costume, the tear on the cuffs. Like, the tear on the cuffs is a slightly different color than it is on the outside. That's very nice. Each individual little... Look at these little pretty things. Look at the detail. They outlined every little nuance of a crevice in this thin black. And then they outlined it all in the buttons. They got the little dings and scratches. I mean, just the wash alone over here. I wish my light would give enough detail, but man, it's just, you got a way darker crease in here. It almost looks like it's kind of cell shaded in a sense because there's just such a uh, good amount. It's not bad by any means necessary, but it's just such small attention to detail. Little rips right here. They may be this one right there, but that's still fine. I mean, if you just look at the fingers, man. Like, look at the fingers. At that detail. The little bumps and ridges. It almost looks like it's, I don't know, like it's just mutated. I am. But, man, it's just, it's so amazing. And oh my god, look at that, dude. Look at that. Look at that attention to detail, the shading, airbrush, what, however they did it. I don't even care, dude. It just looks so good. Like, the musculature right here, look at that. That is so good. It even goes in a little bit, all the way out with the black. All the way down. I mean, it's amazing paintwork. It's absolutely astounding paintwork. Look at that. Just like the smallest little detail. 
they even went so far as to have the little lines drawn under the fingernails. I mean, you got a little Marcellus Wallace scar back there, dude. That is sick. Just the tonality of the... Man, I don't know, man. I can't stop thinking about how this musculature is so great. God, it's just... Man, it's awesome, dude. For 50... What is this? This was $50? 50, 50 bucks, dude. You just can't compare. You really can't compare when it comes to any kind of terms of money you spend on a figure. I mean, if you're going to spend $50, I mean, I feel like this is the kind of quality figure you want to get. Like, oh, I may have to heat that up a little bit. Nope, you're good to go. You passed the test. I don't know, man. It's just so good. I'm just so impressed with this figure. I just don't even want to talk. I just want to move it around. But that's not what you're here for. Just so impressive. All right, let's check out some accessories. First accessories, we have these rigor mortis kind of open hands. Really does bring back some Ernest Scared Stupid vibes. Maybe even some killer clowns. Hey, NECA, why don't you tell us about some killer clowns? I'd love to see some stuff. All right, next up, we got two knuckle sandwiches. These things are equally as detailed. It's just, I can't get over the sculpting, dude. Just for the, for the 50 bucks, the sculpt alone is worth it. it even... And next up, we have two pair of hands that are doing their best at trying to do a sign language E. This little thing is what I'm talking about. Look at this. Look at this little turd of a carrot that's supposed to be his tail. And I mean, oh, there we go. I mean, that's fine. It looks really, I don't know if I can get too close. It's going to zoom out. With, but I mean, maybe there's a little bit of too much black marks on here, personally. But I don't think it's really going to take away from it. I mean, I didn't put this tail on him to display him. But. Bindi? I don't even know how I could have forgotten to mention. What I even said was one of the most classic trademarks of him. <sighs> This gun. This gun brings back memories of Nintendo, of Blockbuster, of seeing the cover of this game every single time we went in there. And every single time me and my bro rented it, took it home, played it for five days, and then returned it. And then a week later, we would get it again. Dude, it's just... This is just 100% nostalgia, childhood, memories, all that kind of stuff. Man, it's great. Okay, so check this out. All right. This is a $50 figure. I actually believe it's $54.99, but I could be wrong on that. Tell me if I am or not. Definitely let me hear from y'all about anything going on with this. All right. Anyway. Okay, so you get $50 bucks with this. $50, and he came with a hand or two hands and another head, which is still cool, but... The boringness and plainness of this. Sure, like, it looks cool, but it's one note with maybe some specks under a crease of an arm. This is one solid piece. No color, no texturizing, no nothing. Anything. The back of this head, look at this head. It's just one hunk of the same plastic. So, when I'm talking about spending 50 bucks... I'm glad I caught this one on clearance because there was absolutely no way I was going to spend 50 bucks on this I'm, or 60 bucks. I'm sorry. Roughly. Let's just say after tax what state you live in, shut up. We're doing it that way. I would not want to spend $50 on this figure, but in turn, the sure his articulation isn't where, you know, it should be, but that was absolutely fine. I knew what I was getting into with this guy. Yeah, so I just popped on this hand, bent it a little bit, and I heard, all I heard was, <laughs> and I was like, ah, the chip's already starting, or the paint's already starting to chip there. But that's still, I don't care. That's still fine. But like, just the attitude this figure exudes, man. Like, it's just, man, I'm here to play around, dude. Who wants so? Who wants so? Man, it's just sick. I guess overall, like I had the tail in there and it fell out. I don't feel like jamming that thing up its little BH right now, but yeah, I don't know. I mean, overall, I'd say I'm not upset at all about this figure. 
it is exactly what I thought it was going to be. It is super dope. I'm going to have a lot of fun with it. I'm going to post more pictures. I'm definitely going to put up some shorts and some TikToks about it. But man, I can't wait to just see what this bad boy can do. No, oh, what was it? There was one other thing. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to keep this in because this is real shit. This is a video review. I wasn't expecting to do this today at all. I had no intention. Let's just say, overall, this figure is a 9 out of 10. Just the sculpt and paint and detail and time they put into making this thing look the way it does. It is just fantastic all around. Could the articulation be a little better? Yeah. Uh, I'm not going to go through articulation either, by the way. I don't. Maybe I will at some point, but I really just don't. I don't know. As more reviews come, I'll become better formatted and stuff like that. But I feel like as I'm moving it around for you and I'm showing you what it can do and I'm hitting poses and stuff of all this sick things, I feel like the articulation should speak for itself. So I'm not really going to worry about the articulation segment so much, but maybe it'll change. I don't know if y'all just want to bear with me, dude, but couldn't be happier with this guy. Let me know what y'all think though. Comment down below, subscribe if you want to love it or hate it. I'm doing what I'm doing. So if y'all like it, keep on watching. And if you don't, man, I hope y'all come back at some point in time. But other than that, uh, yeah, let's just say thank y'all for watching and tune back in. I think you're going to like some of this stuff. We'll see.